Well, welcome everybody. We're back here on UO Alive. And my brother and I are sitting here at an eye dock. It's we think it's gonna happen here pretty quick. As you can see, it's right here across from Scara. Scara's right there. We're just right there. Never been to an iDoc on this server, so this will be a learning experience. I hear there's going to be, well, if you go by what everybody's saying, that there will be there will be uh, monsters attacking. So, we're just waiting. I actually wasn't even going to record it. I just was sitting here and I thought, you know what? <laughs> this might be interesting. May end up dying. Who knows? That's my brother to my left. And this is me right here. There's my brother. So, I guess we'll see what happens. If it seems to be too long, I may pause the, pause the video, but who knows? You can see all these goofy people running around doing stuff. Oh well, I could have put another trash. Ah, sorry. I just looked up on my cameras and seen the uh, trash guy just pulled up. I had a bag I could have put out, but uh, too late now. Oh well. Well, I don't know what's going to happen here. everybody that's here My dog. I have no idea what he just heard. Probably something on the game. Now my phone. Oh, it's okay. It's my sister. Well, I don't know what's going on here. I don't know what we're supposed to be doing. I have no idea. All the boxes are still secure. So I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? inside. I don't know 
what it is. Wow. Gives the person ideas. Got a bar up here, or uh, uh, who knows? Oh, his own little rune library. I like that stairway right there. It's kind of cool. <laughs> I re I found there was some spot on their I don't know their wiki or their form or somewhere. There was something about Idox, but I didn't read it. <clears throat> so who knows? I guess I'll see. or not. I don't think so. I got mark scrolls, but oh well, you know what? kind of boring. Structure and danger collapse, that's what I was saying earlier. Oh wow. Huh. Use the windows out of the other kind of building. Oh, it's got different signs, kinds all over it, I guess. <laughs> what did she say? Well...
Well, it's only been 11 minutes, but it seems like an eternity already. Well, 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 well. This is getting a bit boring. But I just went in and took some pictures. It's pretty it's a pretty cool house. And it's on a uh That's on a castle plot, I think. Yeah, that's big enough for a castle plot. 
on this server you can they have uh, you know like on retail you only get 18 by 18 <coughs> or a pre-made castle or keep well on here they were smart and offered the the keep and the castle plot as a blank plot so you can build whatever you want which retail could have did but no no we can't do that so yeah <clears throat> now it's kind of expensive the plot I think the castle is like 8.5 million or something and it keeps less but I won't have one of them for quite a while so <clears throat> I've got a little uh, uh I think yeah I've showed I don't know if I've showed our new houses on on my videos yet or not <clears throat> I haven't made a video for a while me and my brother got houses right beside each other he doesn't really need a big house and I made a big one just because I wanted to have a big front yard to display stuff on so <clears throat> we're uh, south of you right off just kind of right beside a road the road doesn't show next to the house but it's there but uh yeah it would be nice to do I'd like to do one of these someday after I make some money I'm only up at well, I was at 123k, but I bought I bought a uh, I bought that and a new pair of leggings because uh, I got my uh, I got my stats up. <laughs> a little higher uh, what I was trying to go for was mana regen which if I put my because I was in hunt I was in killing dragons and I had no mana regen at all so right now it's four but if when I go in there I use my dragon uh, sword and I can I can use my uh, uh, my shield which is this right here which gives me another so I got six mana, G, uh, mana regen so which helps because every time I use the uh, the one special attack it uses mana now the ideal thing would be to have a dragon slayer with mana you know leech on it but <laughs> again <laughs> I think there's one out there but it's like ugh, ungodly amount of money so I just used the the uh, dragon slayer I got which is right oh it's right here somewhere there it is dragon's end <coughs> it's the one that's in the regular game but it works real good it really does but uh, currently before this eye doc I had taken my uh, swordsmanship off which as you can see where we're at right here and I had changed it to archer and I had it I got it up to 50 50.2 or something <coughs> and that was uh yeah I bought it 400 I bought up to 40 and then and then uh, I was doing the skill I was just training shooting arrows and then this came up my brother sent me a picture of it so I thought you know what I came over and thought you know what I think I better go back and put my swordsmanship back on which I did real quick and uh, so Uh, hit regen, stamina regen. See, when I'm wearing my, when I got my sword, what does it have? 
Any damage increase 60%. Yeah, so I've only got 30% now. I've got 90% when I have my when I'm doing dragons because I have my shield and my dragon's edge, which gets me up there a lot higher. But this was the best I could do right now, and I had to have mana leech and I have to have life leech when I'm just fighting everything. It's kind of a well-rounded axe for the money. I mean. <laughs> I'm sure I could spend a hundred thousand now and probably get a little bit better one, but then I'm down no money again. So I'm just gonna go with this one right now and <clears throat> repairing's empty or empty free, so they have benches here to repair with. So we'll just go with that and what do I got on here? See I'm way down on everything. When I put my sword in my hand and my shield on, I've got almost, I got 70s on almost everything, and then my physical's down a little bit. I guess I could have. Eh, I don't have none of them with me. I got some other swords that I could have put. I could have put a sword, I had another kind of sword, a scimitar or something that did a lot of good stuff. And I could have worn my, had my uh, shield in my hand. But, oh well. This is fine. For right now. Oh shoot, I forgot to go get, uh, I gotta add some tithing points. Or tiding points, whatever you want to call them. This guy thinks he has to. Do all this fire. I hope 400 points is enough for this. I'm scared. I don't know what this is going to take. hoping somebody wasn't standing in my spot. I feel better. I got, yeah, 5,300 now. It's purple. Five minutes. It's got to be getting close. <clears throat> Wish I'd hurry up. I got some other stuff I need to do.
I doubt that came over my mic. But my dog just snored like big time. And I looked at him and he woke up and looked right up at me like, oops. You're a dork, you know. Yeah, he knows he's a dork. His bed is underneath my desk. I think I'm gonna <coughs> at the first when I first started this server which again this is you all alive I uh, I did something oh if you join the the discord and the uh, forum you get a they give you a uh, mythic coin which is the 590s on skill you can make a character so I think I'm gonna go ahead I've been debating and debating what to use it on and I think I'm gonna go ahead and do my crafter I like the crafting but I don't like building a crafter and if you get 590s then I can you know pick five different things so I want to be able to make some clothes, some hooded shrouds, stuff like that. And then, I don't know, one thing that, in my thoughts, my feelings, the, the imbuing, it it kind of ruined having a you know a blacksmith and making your own armor because I think they ought to be comparable to each other I think they should have made imbuing I, I don't know I don't know how they could have done something but I think making armor with a blacksmith should have been still something you could do that you had to be a 120 blacksmith to make the best stuff and you had chances of making some really good stuff and and then they added imbuing and I think that kind of ruined now on here I don't know I haven't looked into the crafting part on this they have actually did a lot of good stuff on here that I was reading earlier about pure mages that they they have did what retail should have done when they upped everything else they just didn't worry about pure mages and kind of left them by the wayside down here they made mages where they are pretty powerful so at least that's what I was reading so I don't know uh, I just have to decide what to do I I'm definitely gonna do a crafter now the skills I pick, so you get, on this shard, you get, uh, was it on this one? Oh, it's not on this guy. I don't have it on this guy. Uh, but you get a bunch of free ones. Let me look on my Discord real quick, because I know I got it. Uh, let's see. I just sent that to my brother. Oh, he said something to me. Uh, I 
set that to him just oh come on where is it I just sent that to him I'm scrolling back up through oh is that it nope there it is uh, arms lore, begging, bowcrafting, camping, cartography, cooking, detecting hidden, fishing, forensic, forensic evalu evalu evaluation, <laughs> herding, mining, item identification, lock picking, lumberjacking, mining, remove trap, taste identification, and tracking are all free skills on this shard. And which is why I have lumberjacking right here at 100%. So I'm over Zim at 736. But it doesn't count towards your 720 or 30 or whatever it is. You just get it. And I didn't even train that. That's just from using my axe on killing things. It went up to 100%. So, if I build a crafter with whatever, carpentry and tinkering or something, I'm going to have... I can my lumberjack will go up just immediately as soon as I start chopping on things. Or I could trade that off, pull it off onto a stone and pull it onto my crafter and already have it on there and just turn this one back on and it'll go back up. Yeah, I don't know. There may be a bonus for having lumberjacking. I don't know. Who knows? I think there used to be in retail there was for having lumberjacking on your fighter, but I'm not really sure. That was a long time ago. But, uh, yeah. So, I don't know. That means my crafter, my crafter could actually have tons on him. He could go ahead and have bow crafting, uh, cooking. Uh, if I wanted to do fishing on him for food, uh, whatever mining so see he's blacksmith and he get mining on there for free so a crafter on here can do a lot of stuff <clears throat> and then you can really get into that this is uh i am am every day i play on this server i am amazed at what they have done and i have no idea i mean i know there's got to be one person in charge but undoubtedly he's got more people so, I just, uh, <laughs> and yeah, they take donations, which if you do don donations, you get uh, sovereigns, which you can't, you don't get gold though. <laughs> there is no way to, there's, on this game server, that's one thing they made sure. You, there is no, you can't get gold on here. So, but you can have other things. You get sovereign, so you can buy all the regular stuff. And then I think I don't know if I showed it. They've got a on Magentia the the uh, area right there where they have the raised beds, which nobody uses. <laughs> nobody. You think retail would have seen that nobody uses it and go, huh? Let's do something different with that. But no, they they can't do anything like that. There, they on here they have stones. That it's a it's kind of a oh it's a magical place that they have uh, stones all the way around it. You can get stuff off of uh, you can we can pay buy stuff with sovereigns and I mean there's just a lot of stuff on there. I I, I think I showed it in one of my videos, but uh, it's just unreal. I mean all the stuff you can buy now. Which, I, I, basically, it's cosmetic stuff. I mean, I did buy, with Sovereigns, I bought the Undertaker Staff because I think it's an essential. It's a no-brainer not to buy. I mean, to, to not buy it is stupid. It's, it's, uh, <clears throat> that's, and, and that kind of builds on another thing on this, this server that they take out the stupid stuff. The stuff, okay, training on here goes way faster than than uh, regular retail. 
and I understand it. It's like, why spend six months building a, a doing all this training and training? That's the only thing you can do is training, trying to get your skill up. You know, so then you're not playing the game. You're missing out on a lot of stuff. So here. My sword fire, this guy right here with all these skills, I did that in probably a couple days. And that was just regular playing. That was not, and that wasn't no, no, you know, scripts or anything. That was just, I play, started playing in New Haven, killing uh, skeletons, and then they, oh, they have a newbie dungeon at New Haven that is, uh, retail has just, fucked up one down below. It's stupid. They've got one right there in town in New Haven that you can just go right into it and it progressively gets harder as you go down and you just start out with what you can and you start doing better and better and get your skills up and you actually move down a little farther and start killing a little bit worse things and yep, it's uh, it's pretty cool. So I had this guy ready in, in two days. Uh, I need to get I need to get a deal to get me up to 120 on that, or it'd already be there. But <sighs> scrolls are expensive. You can get some, but other the 120s are pretty high. I don't know when I'll get a chance to get those, but. I can buy 115 right now. I could probably buy 110 and a few of these, but I figured just wait. It, I don't really have to have it. I may go ahead and run this on up to 115, but I don't know. We'll just we'll see. Well, getting a few more people here. Oh, who said that? My brother said that me? I don't know. <laughs> the waiting is the best part. <laughs> oh, another hour. No, no, no. <laughs> That's not going to be fun. I won't make you guys wait for another hour. Even though we are kind of having fun, but still. Oh, and if you haven't noticed, I am using, this is uh, UO Classic. Uh, this is UO Classic with, uh, with Razor, Enhanced Razor. Uh, if I show you, here's my, oh, you can't see it, dang it. Uh, <laughs> I'm actually moving around on the screen, my Razor tab. Uh, uh, I don't know how I don't know how I could show that. Oh well, that's okay. Having a razor is see it's another one of those things that you could have allowed 
only thing I use it for is looting. It's just, I just, it's stupid to have to stop and do that. It's just wasting time. I have it right now where it picks up all the jewels when I'm doing dragons. That's the only reason that's on there. But mainly, it, normally, it just picks up gold. <clears throat> and it picks up within a two-tile area of what I just killed. So, you know, that's pretty handy. You know, I don't mess with that. Because gold, sometimes it's pain in the butt trying to pick it up. Or, and when you get on the jewels, they're so small. That's what made that nice. And you got dragons running around, so. And then, uh, yep. And I don't care about scripting here. It's as far as training skill. You can do it. They don't. They don't. You know. They don't get in trouble for it. So. Come on, about my brother. I can see a little better over here. They have the. Uh, Little line up here tells you all their stuff, and I added uh, the tithing to it. This is an enhanced uh, health bar, uh, the old style. And this is, and you probably can't see this. If you're, oh, you can see it, good. This is the uh, options, they're, they're night and day to what regular UO has. They have so many added stuff on here. Stuff they should have had years ago. Oh, that's why this, my backpack, that's not normal size. My norm, my backpack's like twice as big. Containers, see I have it up to 100, scaled up to 149. And I scale on the items that are inside of it to match it. So you can find stuff in your backpack. Yeah, I'd kind of like to have the enhanced version with the squares, keeping everything separate. Well, that's, it's pretty nice, but this makes it doable. And you can still use the different backpacks, the furry one and whatever, the different one styles they have. But, yep, you get all those. Uh, that's my info bar, so you can add stuff to it, make it wider with more stuff on it. Uh, oh, that's these boxes right here that I put right there. There's my bandages, my enhanced bandages, my gold. That's what that was for. Uh, got a few added things on here. I've got a lot of macros. Just for fighting. You can turn the frame rate up. The gameplay window. Well, on here it's you, know, you can stretch it to whatever you want. <clears throat> I could do full screen if I wanted to, but I don't want to. And make sure I can put all this stuff on here. And there's your map. Map's a lot more enhanced. Oh, where your health bars and all that, every stuff uh, comes up, you can move it. It usually comes up over here. If I change this, it'll move it up, come over here, in which I've been meaning to do that because your eyes, I don't know if it's because I'm right-handed or what, but you, you mainly look to the right. You notice things to the right, and I've had more than one person say that, so I just never have done it yet. I've been going to change it over to the right side, which you just change your X and your Y. Well, we're all 
all still here. And we've been going for 46 minutes. Hey, you just hurt yourself, buddy. Well, we're still sitting here. Take another picture real quick. Just the people that are here. Let me add them to my uh, my video at the end or something. This may be scary. Never done this before. They're talking about monsters, so who knows what skill level these monsters are going to be. I'm just a 110 swordsman, so I'm 100% on, on everything else, so who knows. And my axe is pretty good. I bet you 101. Yeah, look at that. Vendor search. While we're sitting here. This is what they did. This is handy. Uh, let's look at weapons. Let's look at swords. Let's add... Light leech and hit. Well, I don't really need. Yeah, middle leech. Oh, dang it. Okay. And search. They came up pretty fast. Whew. That went up fast. Look at this. 3,500. You got mana 48, life 40, or 66, hit fatigue, which it don't matter, one-handed weapon. What's this? 15,000. Mana leech, life leech, mana drain. Which I don't care about mana drain. I thought that was gargoyle. What's this? Uh. Oh, jeez. Look at the prizes. I'll tell you this one. So I can wear my I can wear my shield then. Uh, mana leech, life leech. It's only nine. It's only a thousand. Physical damage, hundred percent. Huh. You know what? Just for poops and giggles. bit better 29 to 41 I got D 
damage increase 30%. Swing speed increase. Defense chance is 12. Oh, look at that one. a lot faster swinging. Reflect damage 39%. So I still have my I still have my six mana regen. Wow, it is breezy outside today. Got some nice air coming in my window. I might try that. I had a scimitar. Well, I don't think they had mana leech on them. What am I gonna do for my So I got bleed attack and infecting. E is my, that's my lead attack. Aha! Uh -huh. uh -huh. Did not want to set her that long. Uh oh, what happened? Whoa! Well, I didn't last long. <laughs> so there's a healer down here. I don't know how far. There he is. Thank God for a stick. Wasn't no fun. Oh, wow.
Well, that didn't work out very well. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I guess I'm not going to try. <laughs> uh, stay back and watch. Chicken. I think that's what killed me a little bit ago. can't heal you. Well, I guess I could have. what they're all doing. <laughs> they're my brother. <clears throat> He's in here. Huh. I don't know what we're doing. Well, I don't know what they're doing. Guess I'll, guess I'll definitely read up on this.
I guess next time I'll try bringing my mage. <clears throat> then at least I can, uh, I can, uh, Send some vortexes or something. Yeah. Well, this was definitely a learning experience. real quick. <coughs> uh, that's a rune library there. One of many. But this is what I was talking about all the stones. There's a moon gate to it. Uh, there's a banker. Uh, you can buy there's mounts. 
decorations, consumables, just everything you think of that you can buy here. Player and pet dries, die tubs. So you can buy all the die tubs here you want, which I do need to get one. Halloween stuff, Thanksgiving, Christmas, Valentine's, and Independence Day. School Power Rewards, Holy Grail Rewards. There's a quest for the Holy Grail. It's called the Holy Grail quest. Uh, just more. Oh, you can turn them in as to if you collect them, and you don't, you're not an imbuer, you can sell them. And here they have a thing called brick coins. If you set you 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 get brick coins just for being here. Uh, nope, not that. W a l l e t. <coughs> Oops, I must have misspelled something. Oh, I did. I messed up. This is your wallet. This is my brick coins that I have built up. 4,600, which you can trade them in. Uh, this is my sovereigns. But this is my brick coins. It's got 4,500. You can actually go to here and you can trade them in. So, like for 1,500, I get 100 sovereigns. So, I had 4,000. So, I get probably, what, 250 in in sovereigns it, it adds up it's free <laughs> it doesn't cost you anything so yep uh, sovereigns or gold oh we have gold if you want to buy if you want to get sovereigns you can use gold and buy sovereigns which I don't know a million gold will give you a thousand sovereigns Lowest I go is 5,000. We'll give you five sovereigns. And then this one, event tokens. Oh, uh, there's power scroll thing. I don't understand that. You can trade in power scrolls. I, I don't know much about that one. My brother told me some, and I don't I didn't remember. I don't remember what he told me now. But anyway, this is this is a pretty neat place. Then my house used to be. The only reason I came across this of uh, somebody built, oh no, right here. I used to have a house right here. About the same size. <laughs> yep, that's where my house used to sit right there. But now, me and Mike both have houses right here. This is mine, the larger one. And that one's his. I wanted a big front yard. I may end up taking them off the roof, make it taller. I don't know. Who knows? I don't really need it. You only use the top bottom floor anyway. So. But that's it. You got to see an eye doc. Uh, you have to attack and you see I died. <laughs> and I have pretty good skills. So it's pretty mean stuff. So that tells me that a sword fighter is not what you need to use. This next time I'll use a uh, some I'll either I have a mystic I have a uh, mystic spellweaver and he's a mage so I can uh, they have oh that's something cool they have here your mage has summon creature well on retail it just summons cows and sheep and rabbits and stuff like that nothing good on here it it does <laughs> it brings in all kinds of cool stuff I mean dragons crimson dragons all kinds of bad stuff and they summon them in and they stay for quite a while I mean a couple two three minutes that's pretty good so you can you can summon them and tell them to go fight and they'll they'll protect you right off the bat. But you tell them to go in there and fight and they're gonna go in there and fight. So I don't know. I need to mess more with that, but I'm gonna mess with my crafter too, so we can do that. 
in one of these things I'll pick my crafting stuff I need to decide what I'm gonna pick but some of your boxes open up like this large your bank box looks up this big too and I've got too much stuff in here I need to thin it out because I can't put much in here well I had a bunch of oh I know what it was I had a bunch of uh, paragon chests which that's what these used to be oh that one was this was the regular chest that was a Paragon chest. I've got a bunch of them that are not need to be lock picked. Uh, I don't remember what is up with that. Why can't I move that one? That's weird. That was my I won that one. That's because look at the stats on it. All 10, 10, 15, 10. So it's a pretty good deal. Pretty good shield. There's my scimitars. Uh, that wasn't a very good one. I used these for quite a while. Hit lightning. That lightning does pretty dang good. But, oh. That's what I was doing. Hey! Where did the, uh... I have the tunic. Where did it go? I hope there wasn't... No, they can't. I can't think they can steal there. I'm pretty sure you can't. Huh. I could have swore I had the tunic unless I just didn't grab it. It didn't go in here, did it? No, it didn't go in there. Well, we'll figure that out later. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. I heard somebody doing magic. Is that my brother? No? Huh? I thought maybe that was my brother over there. Oh, yeah. Anyway, that's over an hour, so we're good. That's it for now. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to see more, you can, uh, subscribe. It doesn't cost anything. It's just YouTube. <clears throat> but uh, I'll probably do. Like I said, I'll probably do. I either do. I'm changing. I'm gonna change this guy to Archer, and then I'll probably start another character with full archer all the time but I may just put it on here for now I was trying that I need to get that skill up to at least 100 which hopefully it won't take very long and then uh, my crafter it's going to be another person on here unless I want to put that on my second account I don't know I have to decide what I want to do but anyway well Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.